it's Reese Maston here on the Troy Murphy Show. Now guess what, ladies and gentlemen? Good news! Still got my uh, headphone here that I've been suffering from all night. And uh, a bit of hair stuck in my glasses. <laughs> Too much information. Probably useless. You don't really need to know it. But in even better news, ladies and gentlemen, I bought a new car. Yep! <laughs> a new car! Well, not a new car, as in a new car off the showroom floor new car, but a new car as in a second-hand car that is new for my ownership. So really, I've bought a second-hand car. So I call it a new, but not so new, new car. Right. I haven't owned a car in over four years, and having to rely on public transport whilst living in the Cronulla area just isn't the easiest way to live, catching trains and buses, whilst they work, aren't the most convenient. And while I don't mind walking the 30 minute plus walk from my place to any public transport, it just became too much, especially if one ran out of milk. That's a long way to walk, to get a little bit of milk. That's an hour round trip. So I had this new found freedom of a not so new but new new car. And it's amazing. But what comes with a new car comes all this responsibility. Ugh. All this stuff that really in my mind is secondary. Especially when it comes to the most important. And I think this is the highest of all priorities when it comes to owning a not so new but new new car. Or a new car for that matter. And that, my friends, is naming one's car, whether it be a brand new car or a not so new, new, but new, new car. <laughs> a car needs a name, and I am stuck. I have no idea what to name my new car. I haven't even given it a gender either. The gender is even more important than the name, because without the gender, how can you name one's car? Oh, the decisions. Oh, the choice! It's so hard. So that is why <laughs> uh, I might put it to the wisdom of social media. Yep, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to take your suggestions on what I should call my car. So on the Troy Murphy Show's Facebook page, I have put a picture of my not-so-new but new-new car, and I will take suggestions from the comments under the photo. Now, for those who aren't playing on social media at home, I guess I can take phone calls too, 9545-9545-1800, that's, that's the number here. Uh, but, I better describe the, uh, the car first. It's a smallish four-door dark silver Toyota model Corolla. Crayon has crossed my mind as a name, because a Crayola, Crayon, good name. <laughs> Good name. Uh, and also, uh, for those who like to name things after number plates, number plate starts with the the, uh, the letters YON, Y-O-N. Sounding a bit Japanese. Got turning Japanese. No, uh, uh, so there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Time to interact. Time to get involved. Jump on the Troy Murphy Show uh, page and start commenting. Let's name my little beast of a not-so-new, but new new car. That's going to get very, very confusing very, very soon. It's the Troy Murphy Show.